Have you ever wondered what happened to India's Chandrayaan-3 mission after its historic landing on the moon? Well, let's take a step back and dive into the details of that monumental event. In the year 2023, India etched its name in the annals of space exploration history. The Chandrayaan-3 mission, a venture of the Indian Space Research Organization or ISRO, successfully touched down near the moon's south pole. This achievement was no small feat, making India the fourth country in the world to land a spacecraft on the moon, joining the ranks of Russia, the United States and China. Now, why the South Pole you may ask? This region of the moon holds a certain allure for scientists and space enthusiasts alike. It's believed to be rich in reserves of frozen water and precious elements, a potential treasure trove for future lunar missions, and possibly even habitation. The Chandrayaan-3 mission was specifically designed to explore this uncharted territory and provide valuable data on the properties of lunar soil and rocks. But this mission was not just about scientific exploration. It was also a testament to India's technological prowess. Remember, India's previous attempt to land near the South Pole in 2019 ended in failure due to a software glitch. So, the success of Chandrayaan-3 was a resounding comeback, a testament to the resilience and determination of the nation's scientists and engineers. The successful landing of Chandrayaan-3 was more than just a win for India. It was a moment of national pride, showcasing India's technological prowess on a global stage. This achievement was not just about reaching the moon, it was about proving to the world and to themselves that with dedication, hard work, and a little bit of lunar luck, anything is possible. But what happened after the historic landing of Chandrayaan-3? The initial success of the Chandrayaan-3 mission was truly a sight to behold. The lander, Vikram, had successfully made its way to the lunar south pole, a first in the history of space exploration. This part of the moon, often overlooked, was now receiving its first terrestrial visitor, and it came bearing the hopes and dreams of a nation. Vikram's mission was not just to land, but to deliver the Pragyan rover to this unexplored region. This robotic explorer was tasked with a mission of critical importance, to examine the composition of the South Pole's lunar soil and rocks, a task expected to last about two weeks before the onset of the lunar night. This was not just a mission to gather data, but also a quest to uncover the potential resources that could support future moon bases. The rover, Pragyan, began its work with a fervor matched only by the team back on Earth. The composition of the moon's south pole was a mystery waiting to be unraveled, and Pragyan was the key. The information it gathered would not only add to our understanding of the moon, but could also pave the way for future lunar missions. As each day passed, the team meticulously analyzed the data sent back by Pragyan. The rover, like a diligent student, sent back a wealth of information, bit by bit, adding layer upon layer to our understanding of the lunar south pole. But as the days turned into weeks, the lunar night began to cast its long cold shadow over the south pole. The team knew that the Pragyan rover, designed to operate in the harsh lunar day, would not survive the extreme cold of the lunar night. But they had planned for this. The mission was designed to gather as much data as possible before the lunar night set in. Everything seemed to be going according to plan, but then something unexpected occurred. Just when everything seemed perfect, things took an unexpected turn. The Chandrayaan-3 mission, a historic achievement for India, experienced an unexpected failure a month after its successful landing on the moon. This was a surprising twist in the tale for a mission that had already made headlines worldwide. The Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft had landed near the moon's south pole, marking a significant step for India in the global space race. It was a moment of national pride, showcasing India's technological prowess on an international stage. The mission aimed to provide crucial data on the properties of lunar soil and rocks, and the South Pole region was of particular interest due to its potential reserves of frozen water and precious elements. However, a month after the successful landing, an unexpected failure occurred. The specifics of the failure are yet to be confirmed by official sources, but it has undoubtedly had an impact on the mission's objectives. The failure has interrupted the data collection process, affecting the mission's primary goal of studying lunar soil and rocks. Beyond the immediate impact on the Chandrayaan-3 mission, this failure has broader implications for India's space exploration ambitions. The mission was more than just a scientific endeavor, it was a symbol of India's growing capabilities in space technology. This setback, although unexpected, is part of the journey towards becoming a major player in the global space industry.
Yet it's important to remember that space exploration is a field marked by both triumphs and setbacks. While the failure of the Chandrayaan-3 mission is a setback, it's not the end of the road for India's space exploration program. The country's space agency, ISRO, has shown resilience in the face of challenges in the past, and it's expected to do so again. The lessons from this mission will be invaluable for future endeavors. They will provide insights that could help prevent similar failures in the future and contribute to the overall advancement of space technology. In the grand scheme of things, every failure is a stepping stone towards success. As Thomas Edison once said, I have not failed. I've just found 10,000 ways that won't work. It's a sentiment that rings true in the realm of space exploration, where every mission, successful or not, brings us one step closer to understanding the vast mysteries of the universe. This unexpected failure was a setback, but it's not the end of the road for India's space exploration program. Failure, they say, is the stepping stone to success. So, what does the future hold for India's space exploration program? Well, let's start by looking at the lessons gleaned from the Chandrayaan-3 mission. Despite the setback, one cannot overlook the fact that India became the fourth country to land a spacecraft on the moon, and the first to do so, near the South Pole. This in itself is a significant achievement, a testament to India's technological prowess. The Chandrayaan-3 mission also highlighted the importance of resilience. After the failed Chandrayaan-2 mission in 2019 due to a software glitch, India didn't back down. Instead they rolled up their sleeves and went back to work, resulting in the successful landing of Chandrayaan-3. But of course space exploration is not a bed of roses, and the failure of the mission a month after the landing brought valuable insights. It emphasized the need for a more robust system to withstand the harsh lunar environment and the significance of continuous monitoring and real-time data analysis for immediate troubleshooting. Now, let's turn our gaze to the future. India's space exploration journey is far from over, in fact it is just beginning. The Indian Space Research Organization or ISRO has ambitious plans up its sleeves. They are gearing up for a manned mission, a testament to their resolve to keep pushing the boundaries and making their mark in the global space community. Moreover, ISRO aims to increase India's share in the global commercial space market. With the experience and knowledge gained from the Chandrayaan missions, India is well positioned to offer cost-effective solutions in the space industry. Their low-budget aerospace program has already proven that they can achieve significant milestones without burning a hole in the pocket. In conclusion, the Chandrayaan-3 mission, though ended in failure, can be viewed as a stepping stone rather than a stumbling block. It has provided valuable lessons and paved the way for future missions. The journey of space exploration is fraught with challenges and setbacks but as the saying goes, the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. While the Chandrayaan-3 mission may have ended in failure, it has paved the way for future successes in India's space exploration journey.